what I used to say is like, you actually writing, when you start out, you're writing the book to yourself. Mm. Uh, so, so in a way people, you know, ask me all the time, like, what should I write about? Like, I would like, it's, it's a honoring yourself, right? Because if you write a book, it's like saying that your life lessons and the life you have lived so far is worthy, right? Mm. It's wor- It's not, I mean, okay, you will get clients, but it's worthy for you. So, so what you're saying is this is important enough to spend time on, mm. um, which is basically a much deeper process subconsciously than we can imagine, I guess. So, so usually I say like you write it to yourself, which is typically a couple of years ago, maybe three, four, five years ago where you were at, because that's mm. where we feel most passionate and competent and, you know, uh, teaching. So I think like write it to yourself and write something that you wish that someone else told you so it is a unique way so actually every book is actually you know giving an enhanced view of how to go through the process of storytelling or writing a book or whatever we want to write about so i think that's very important but i think there's also an important part in the book in the editing like third second third final round where you basically need to step back and write it to the reader Mm. which is basically your future reader that doesn't exist you're just in your room and you know writing but you need to imagine that future reader that you're actually helping this person because that overlaps your energy to wanting to actually market the book Mm. because then it's not about you it's about helping someone else